Okay, guess Oregon. It might be tough to guess this one. You see little spongy uh, area spaces in the middle. You can see between them is some type of uh, solid tissue. What could this be? Could this be some kind of gland? Is it a salivary gland? Well, if I told you that this was a lung, you'd probably still have a hard time believing me. The first reason is the damn thing hasn't come into focus yet. The second thing is, is that in a lung you would always expect the uh, alveoli, uh, alveolar septae, to look a lot thinner than this. And this is one main thing I want to demonstrate here, is that this is a pneumonia, but the pattern of inflammation is not within the alveoli, it's within the septum. In other words, it's not, you don't see any type of inflammatory cells in these alveoli, but it is in the interstitial tissue between the alveoli. And for this reason, this is called interstitial pneumonia. Interstitial pneumonia is not caused by any one particular type of organism, uh, but I will give you a good rule of thumb, a good general principle, which of course, if you would like to find a bunch of exceptions, you could. But for purposes of sanity, let's say that interstitial pneumonias are more likely caused by viruses or atypical bacteria, whereas alveolar pneumonias, which we don't see here, are more likely caused by regular bacteria. And if you want to take one thing home to the bank, think if the uh, in cells infiltrating the lung are in the alveoli, think bacteria. If the cells infiltrating the alveoli are in the septae, think viruses. Let's go one more power, I hope and uh, take a look and reassure you the fact that these septae look like they're almost as thick as the actual alveola. No, normally you know they should be much, much, much thinner. And sure, we have one, two, three, four. They have a whole bunch of inflammatory cells here. They look like they're chiefly mononuclear, perhaps lymphocytes and macrophages. If uh, you find perhaps an occasional neutrophil like this could be, or maybe these could be, uh, you would say it's not purely lymphocytic. This is interstitial pneumonia, just a morphologic uh, standard and not meant to um, imply that it's caused by any one type of organism. Thank you very much.